Tiny Don't 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 Hello, welcome to the Johnny Cookie Show. We are gonna be making some cinnamon coffee cake. So what you're gonna be needing for this recipe, you'll be needing oops, got it. You'll be needing some cake batter, which which been already made. Ice cream scooper to scoop up your cake batter. Some milk, some cinnamon, actually no. One bowl, some milk, some cinnamon, and a combination of spices. So, and a little, and a little bacon pan with the cake uh, stamper, so you can stamp out your cinnamon coffee cake. Let's get started, and then I'll, and then I'll move, and I'll put the cake up so you can see what the cake is like. Okay? Are you ready? Let's get started. So first, in one bowl, scoop out, scoop out, um, scoop out. Scoop out some scoops of cake batter. Now this is no, so they don't give you a proportion here. So I don't give you a proportion of what the cake is going to be, but it just makes up that shape for the batter. Now if this doesn't work, you can use your um spoon. Now you can make like two scoops, but I'm gonna put some butt. So I'm going, I'm going to put like a little shot of. I'll put I'll, be, I'll put like a little shot of butter on there so then I'll then so then you guys can see that consistency. We will now be mixing our cake up. So it's not just a conflict of when you're making um um cake batter. It's all about making um, creating and captivating. So, that's what we're going to be setting for goal. Now, we're going to be adding a combination of spices. So, uh, today, today's combination of spices is flour, sugar, and some cinnamon. And some burnt cinnamon. Now, we'll mix in the spices. Now, um, now this is, so, um, this is real cake dough. Now, you can buy some, you can, now, you guys can make your own cake dough for the cinnamon and coffee cake, but, now, you can, you can buy some from the store, then you can, like, whip up your own. And I brought this from Family Dollar on Play-Doh store. Now, um, now, there's a lot of places where you might find this cake dough at, but I got it at, um, so I'll put the link where you can go to your cake dough website. Now we'll add in one whole um, bowl of milk. Now we'll blend in. Now that will blend in with the cake dough and the combination of spices. So we want the um. So I need so the combining of this will be will be represented as a um combined. And then we'll put it into our bacon tray. Now we'll make like a second layer. So. After we put this in the oven, we'll, we'll make like, after we get this spread in the pan, we'll make like a second layer. This time without milk, with just the cinnamon. So, yeah. Let's grab our, now it's time to add our cinnamon. So, we only, you got, you only need one scoop, so let me grab my cinnamon here. Now mix it in the cinnamon. Alright, now once you got a fresh today, and once you got a, some fresh dough like this, you you may want to put it in the oven. Now we're gonna grab our baking tray with with the mold in it and dump put a play-doh and put our cake in the batter and we're gonna spread it across the um spread it across the um now you your plate I mean has holes in it but don't worry about it. It may come out a little awful but life's awful so in case you guys don't know. Now if you like this nine to like cinnamon coffee cake please give give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any more um videos.
Now we're making the second layer without milk, but with, with just a, a hint of spice. Now, it, this doesn't include burnt cinnamon. It just has the flour and the sugar. So we're gonna dump that in. Now we're gonna. Now we're not gonna mix and combine this. We're gonna combine everything together after we add our cinnamon. Then you know what we're gonna do. Mix in the cinnamon. So this will be combined it with a with a first layer. And what that's gonna do? It's gonna heat up the guarica and cheap. So you need to mix this as as soon as possible. Cause like if you want to add frosting, I'm not gonna add frosting to the cake. So I'm just I'm just gonna show y'all and then cut a slice and then we'll and then I'll show you what the slice looks like afterwards. All right, now once you got this thin ball of cake dough, we will add it to our second layer. So. Get all the lumps out. I kind of feel this because. Alright, now once you have your dough like all made like this, you're going to pour this on top of your um uh you're going to pour this on top of your first layer of cake. Now then, now nowadays we used to have like a red uh, cake with some you still have like a yellow cake with some chocolate frosting on it. Yeah. So if you like that cake, I recommend you go to the store and pick up a pack and make and whip up that cake. Because it's so good. Now we will bake this in the oven for about five, five to ten minutes and then we'll be back with the results. Alright guys, I now took the cake out of the oven. And now look at it. It kinda look like let me let me zoom in. Now it kinda looks like a um kinda it's kinda like like you know, like what like what you expect at that cake fair. So it's kind of like it kind of like shaved off that. It kind of shaved off that, you know. And now you'll see like a. Now it kind of shaved off that what it made. It kind of makes like a big dent in there. So don't worry about it. So I'm. Um, so thank you for. So thanks for watching another. Uh, Donnie cooking show video. I hope you um. Enjoy your dessert. If you think it was delicious, let me know. Please let me know in the comment section. And um, now here's here's a slice of cake. Ah! Okay, guys, no slice of cake. Now I dropped the cake. So thank you for watching this um cooking video. And have and thanks for watching and have a good day.